I am very happy to be here today on this momentous day for the inaugurations of the Energy Revolution Gallery at the Science Museum. In this gallery, we have a, a, a real mixture of um, striking displays of contemporary technology and some um, historic objects. Proud to be the title sponsor of this stunning new gallery. I am very happy to be here today on this momentous day for the inaugurations of the Energy Revolution Gallery at the Science Museum. We at Adani Green Energy are proud to be the title sponsor of this stunning new gallery. I have always believed that our lives are part of a bigger story. It is a story that connects what our ancestors knew to the future we want to create. In all our actions, we must respect the wisdom of our ancestors while crafting dreams for those yet to born. We are the bridge connecting the past with the future. We are the bridge between generations. It is our duty to take care of our planet, not only for these generations and the next, but also for the generations to come. And I am proud that Adani Green Energy is leading an energy transition that honors that commitment. As the world's leading solar power developer and India's largest renewable energy company, we are taking very big steps. In Khawda, which is in the state of Gujarat, we are building the world largest renewable energy park. It will have a gener generating capacity of 30 gigawatt energy and it is a incredibly big. Its area of 538 square kilometers is more than five times bigger than Paris. We are also aiming to reach 45 gigawatt of renewable energy by 2030. This will be like providing clean energy to almost every house in England. Ladies and gentlemen, museums are very important because they teach us and inspire us. This new gallery is about more than just a clean air or about moving away from oil and gas. It is about the energy transitions we need, this world needs, and it is about the revolutions that is taking place in the world of energy. This gallery is special 
because it makes us think, dream, and wish for change. It shows us how our world, our economy, and our own lives can change for the better. And as elegantly outlined by Sir Bletford, we hope this gallery will teach and inspire people both now and in the future to help create a sustainable world. It's a gallery about the most pressing issue of our times, which is in order to avert the worst impacts of climate change, uh, we need to urgently transition towards lower carbon um, sources and uses of energy. So in this gallery, we have a, a, a real mixture of um, striking displays of contemporary technology and some um, historic objects from the Science Museum's collections. We care for millions of objects, so we brought out some of the latest and greatest for this display, along with some of the stories and objects that talk about some of the history of the current low carbon energy transition. We're in a really crucial um, uh, decade for action um, around the world. And if we can um, seize the opportunity now to make use of these great low carbon energy sources from solar to wind to maybe nuclear energy to different forms of, of low carbon energy sources um, and tr transition towards those and then use um, that energy uh, around um, our everyday lives from moving around from transport to the way we build and uh, heat and cool our buildings in lower carbon ways, then we can reduce the impact of humans on the planet and move towards a, a more sustainable future. And that's what this gallery really highlights, those stories um, from the UK and from around the world um, where people or uh, individuals or communities, companies are imagining these lower carbon futures and the actions they're taking to achieve, um, to achieve their aims. And that's what we're celebrating today.